Hello guys, gals, and non-binary pals. Welcome back to Alien Isolation. Now, I'm very excited about this. In particular because there's no more Xenomorph. Hey dog, welcome. We're relishing in our victory over the alien last episode. How the hell are you? You know what? I'm gonna pour myself a nice cold Coca-Cola. I'm doing pretty good. How are you doing? I always ask because I actually care. Right, let's go and share out the stream real quick. Shared out. Let me get my second screen up and running. But what's she been up to, dog? Oh yeah, you did say you were playing Avatar. I hope you've been having a blast with it. Okay. Let's pour the rest of my soda doda doda. Yeah, it looked fun. And there we go. Just cap that off. And we are good to stream. Oh, let me pull you a little closer. All right. So for anyone who wasn't present last episode, it does have most of the hallmarks of a Ubisoft game. Oh, so like wide open world like bases to overtake and like pointless like map side objectives and clutter and all that kind of mumbo jumbo. That's what I think of when I think Ubisoft. What we're going to be doing right now is we're going to be exploring the station. Hello, Thunder. What? Thunder. Hydrating. Thank you, Queen Sheeta. How are you doing, lovely? I was actually just talking about you two. Not that long ago, IRL. Tired? Oh my goodness. If you gotta get some rest, don't be afraid to. I won't take that kind of stuff personally. Yeah, really. I was talking about, uh, the topic came up of one of my favorite streamers, and I was talking about Queen Sheeta, and we were talking about one of the, uh, like, I got into a conversation about who's your, uh, wildest, uh, chat member, and I was like, easily far and away, that's probably Thunder. Arctic is a close second, but... <laughs> Messing with the game engine. But yeah, Queen Sheeta, you're easily, like, the top five. I don't know why you're shocked about that. Okay. Uh, 
Okay, so let's look at the map. Hmm. Okay, so there's something in the main lobby we've yet to get. Without the xenomorph running around, it's just basically isolation, which is nice. Nothing in here. Oh. Did we get everything in here? Also, we're trying to recuperate all of our loot and make as much stuff as we can before. I'm assuming another alien is going to show up. I have not played this game, so I do not know and I do not want spoilers, but I'm assuming we're probably going to find out that there's a nest and that we're probably gonna be, it's probably going to be, Ripley, save us, and some shit like it always is in these kind of stories. Because whether it be Ripley or her daughter, everyone be crying after Ripley to solve their problems. Oh, ha ha, I knew there was probably something I was missing here. Hello. It's always been a fascination of mine that I've always wanted to cut metal like that. It always looks super fulfilling. Maybe that's just me. I don't know. Could be. So there's two directions to go. First we're gonna go here. And use this lever and open that. <gasps> Medkit level two, baby! Ha ha ha! Now that's what I'm talking about. Oh. Blasting cap and a sensor. Okay, we gotta find something that uses a blasting cap and a sensor. Um, let's see. Blasting cap and sensor, right there. Okay. That was a weird little mini game. Alright. Flamethrower fuel, another sensor, easy, I'm going to put it on the pipe bomb. We're just going to craft a pipe bomb, because those are always useful. We're going to reload this bad bitch. I don't know why there's no audio for re reloading the flamethrower right now. This place has been in bad shape for a long time. Why the fuck was my flashlight on? Oh, that's annoying. Welcome back. Thank you for supporting the channel, dog. I always appreciate it. Oh, I guess we can go that way. It might not seem like a lot, and it might seem annoying and tedious, but it really does help make a difference and keep me doing this as often as I do it. Hey, Ren! You've never finished the game yourself? I mean, it's hard, Cheetah. It's a hard game. I Honestly, I'm just glad that we got rid of the Xenomorph. It gives me a minute of levity, even if if it's brief or if it's not, I don't know. But, like, I, I really needed that moment. Okay, nothing in here, it looks like. Ooh. Scrap, always useful. Hey, Ren, Ren, Ren! Ren, 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 Ren. <laughs> Ah, I'm in a good mood today. Sorry about... Well, not, I'm not sorry about that, actually. I'm not going to apologize for that. That's silly. But oh, sorry if I'm a little extra talkative than normal. I'm just trying to stay upbeat and have a good time. Oh. Well. Business as usual. Let's go cap us an android. Take your fucking lumps! Carefully. 
I want you to leave work now. Collect Hi, Ren. We need to find some place safe till Seeks and send a ship. I saw the guy from the class, but don't I can't remember his name. The one in the dirty baseball cap and the spell. He had something in his coat. I think it was a gun. Just look like Don't talk to anyone. Don't tell them where you're going. I'll meet you as soon as I can. Okay, that's that door opened. No, that dude's dead as hell. I will take both of those. Thank you. Oh, and that. Thank you, you two. Those are some, those are some generous dead people. Give me all that shit. Can we go back through here, finally? Probably can. Yes, we can, bitches. Pop, pop. Hmm. Oh, we're back in the server farm. Whoa, B. Huh. I'll take it. That's interesting. I didn't think that that would be that shortcut. Let's find one charge pack. Uh, I guess we'll make that and then make one of these charge packs. You're good, Ren Ren. All right. Also, again, I, I've been trying to say this now in all the in all the live streams when somebody's present. Oh, hang on. Oh, what the? Hang on. Just give, hold that thought. Die, fake person. Okay. Anyways, but uh, if you guys want to support the channel on a more uh, in another more helpful way without having to uh, spend any monetary transactions or anything like that you could always subscribe to the youtube channel watch the videos or uh, have them play in the background or even just like the videos all three or even comment like tell me your favorite part of it or just pop in say hi i read all the comments and i reply as soon as i read them and to all of you who've just really been doing that i mean it means the, it means the world to me and it's the same username as it is on here. It's Miwa the Fox, and my channel should come up. So if you ever feel like spending a little extra, like minute or two, supporting my content, I always appreciate the help. Okay. We gotta find an access rewire. Looks like that's over by coolant control, and I don't think that that'll. Oh, uh, yep, nope, that's gonna hurt us. Okay. We all have that friend that cares about us but scares us a little inside. Ooh, blasting cap. Okay, I don't know if I went this way. Secrets, maybe? <laughs> it's weird you can't stand up. She's mad about your art? That's rude. Why is that? Art is not something to be mad about. It's something to embrace about a culture. You know, us humans have been making art for, like, ever. <laughs> and I don't see anything wrong with your art, Ren. What, it, what does that have to do with it? You could be drawing, like, for, for pardon my land, like, well, pardon the descriptor, but you could be drawing big tittied anime girls. Ain't no one got a right to tell you what you should or shouldn't be drawing. This 
This is the land of the free, Ren, and you're just as entitled to all of those freedoms as everybody else. So don't let some jerk face tell you what you should or shouldn't want to draw. Wholesome or lewd, that doesn't have any uh, change on the subject. Your art is amazing, and I'm glad that you embrace it and draw. Honestly, you have some of the best artwork I've seen in a long time. Sometimes, like, well, not sometimes, but like, whenever I see it, I'm always stunned by how good your artwork is. Time to test a theory. Was this oil? Nope. But now he's on fire. So good thing I didn't test that when the alien was here, otherwise I would have been screwed. <laughs> You know, let's get a, uh, if you guys want to participate, let's get a hashtag Ren Art, if you can, if you can in the chat. We're going to support Ren for a second here, so, hashtag R-E-N-A-R-T. Don't pray for my soul before she comes after me. Bleh. Sounds like a heretic. Like, let them come, Ren Kunai. Oh, shit. Shit. Deal with them. Regardless, my point stands, Ren. You can do whatever you want. None of us have any right to tell you uh, what you can or can't do in terms of artistic expression or any kind of allotted freedoms. And thank you for joining, dog. I just saw that. Hell yeah. See, dog gets it. Art is something we embrace. How? How do I get rid of that, though? Ugh. Great. There goes our friggity frill health container. Hmm. Let's look around for clues. Oh, I forgot I was forgot all about the lean. That's the way we came in. Yep. That's the way across. I tried fire last time, but it didn't work. But I'll I'll try again just for posterity. That's what I thought. Like I thought maybe we blow up the the room with flames. Nope. So, yeah. Hmm. That's weird. Like, if the air purification didn't fix it, I don't know what will. So, hang on. Let's go this way. That's that way, so let's go this way. Wait, that's locked off. Thank you for the lurk! And you kick some... human, question mark, ass? I don't know if there's, if there's like enemy tribes for the Na'vi in that game. <laughs> sounds like she... Sounds like she's something inappropriate, right? Hey. 
Hell yeah. Kick that human ass. No, she's probably wrong. You see, that's something I think is kind of sorely missing. It would be cool if there were. Even if it was just a gameplay perspective, like, that would be kind of cool. If there were, like, more, like, uh, human goal-aligned Navi tribes that were, like, banished tribes or whatever. I think that would be a kind of a cool, interesting system that they could implement. Yeah, no, there's just nothing we can do there. That's weird. Right, let's get out of here. Oh yeah, that's where we already went. And I don't think there's anything in this computer that can help us. Wasn't it 7789? Let's see. Well, you were playing as one of the last Sarenta, uh, Sorrentu, a special tribe that could connect to these plants that give them powers and they tell stories to the other tribes. Okay, that sounds kind of neat. I really dug Way of Water. Like, I personally love that movie, but uh, I heard it's kind of a divisive film amongst the fans of that movie. Like, that series. Mm, I just know it was a pretty it was a pretty movie and it, I liked its themes. I felt I felt kind of represented as a Native American in that kind of topical of stories. Cause it's like I can resonate with that kind of story a lot more. Oh what the hell? Who's down here? I swear I'm getting motion, but there's nothing up here. I feel like Hicks right now. He's like, he's right. There's nothing back here. Hello, Rewire Access. Can you help downstairs? Nope, just Fen Access. Dang, okay. Oh, Blasting Cap. Those are always in short supply. And a free charge pack. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, well, that was all I could get on that side. Nothing there. I'm switching to something else. Why do I make like rustling noises every time I look in a direction? It's it's annoying. But I mean, it's dope. I'm glad you're enjoying your game, though. Pun, I puns me. Oh my goodness, uh, dog. My brain's all over the place. I apologize. My lordy Rue. I do declare. Sorry, access that. Access those. Just for posterity, access that. Okay. What's this? Oh. Oh. 
Oh, there you are, friend. Oh, shit. Okay. Back off. Keep me sabi. Yeah. So a sensor. I'm glad you're laughing. I love that you're having a good, at least having a good laugh at something. Wrestling noise. Good, it did. I don't know why. It's just, like weird, like draggy sound whenever I walk places. Oh, it looked like I just straight like clocked it with the thing I had in my hand for a minute. I was like, that's hilarious. <laughs> Never know when we might need to unlock these, so unlock them while we can. Back. Okay, yeah, we've been here already. Good. Guess we look through here now. Take that. Hello. Blasting caps! Hello. Gotta love getting gear. Okay, so all of that is handled. Let's go down to communications real quick. Let's look around here. Did we loot this dead guy? Nope. 
But he's got a sensor on him, so that's something. Damn. That android got fucked up. Oh, yeah! Another Nostromo log! Oh, it's Dallas! When we get back home, I want a meeting with a shipping coordinator. My usual science officer has been replaced. No reason given. The new guy is more than capable, I'm sure, but only getting two days' notice for this kind of thing is crazy. I just like an explanation. We'll be ready for our load when we get the call. Dallas, Nostromo Captain, signing off. Okay. That's some awesome lore that about Ash being a uh, like immediate replacement and like it kind of rubbed the captain the wrong way. I love that personally. I don't know, it's it sounded like it could have been the original actor, but I haven't rewatched that movie recently recently to know his voice distinctively. Like I would be able to like Ripley or anybody else. My okay. But seriously, that's really cool. And if it was him, like I'm so glad he came back if he if he did. That's like super admirable. And takes a lot of respect for the character that you play. It's funny to think about back in the 70s, everyone probably thought Captain Dallas was going to be the main character. But then, like, Ripley wound up being the main character. I always find those kinds of things interesting, because, like, that was the 1970s. Like, there were not a lot of movies led by women, you know? Like, that's just fascinating to me. Must have been immense pressure on poor Sigourney Weaver. But just like her character, she probably handled it like a fucking champ. Because, you know, she's Sigourney Weaver and, and is a badass. Okay. Is there like a, uh... Like, lore option? Archived logs. Okay, cool. I was curious. I, I, I forgot if there was or not, so I was wanting to make sure I could always come back to that and, like, look through all the story. I thought I saw it, I thought I saw something. Okay. Okay. Where does this take us? Okay, then. Well, I'll be dipped. That's kind of interesting. I didn't know we could unlock those that way. This game is full of surprises. Okay, hang on. Let me get comfortable again. Uh, support that back when you stream like I do. My biggest tip for any uh, up and coming like hungry streamers is definitely watch your back. That like 
Not like how it sounds like, watch your back. But I mean like... Well, you know what I mean. I didn't wake you because I knew you'd try and stop me. Please understand, this is our best shot. Someone's got to reestablish communications. We need to make sure the officials back at home know what's going on here. Don't worry, God. I'll be back. I'm not gonna leave you in clear blow. And he never came back. <laughs> What I thought it was, but I didn't know for sure. Okay. Well, all right then. VIP treatment, I like. Definitely fix it if you can, like, sit up straighter and do those kinds of things. Gotta take care of ourselves while we're still young, otherwise we're all gonna be in a lot of pain when we're old. Is that like an accessible? Disabled security camera, okay. Didn't know that, that was a thing. There's so many ways you could play this game. It's so fascinating. But, like, I guess I could have just came through here when I did and been, like, super stealthy. Oh, stop going to the flash ring. I'm, like, super stealthy about it, but I wasn't, so I obviously didn't. Why would a fucking Molotov need a sensor on it? That's strange. Revolver equipped. Comms control. That ad looks like those artworks look weird. It looks like they're kissing and she's like, I'm into that shit. up here well hello external comms link okay no idea what that did find whole new areas up in here. This is the commercial vessel Torrens out of St. Clair, registration number MSV7760, calling Sebastopol Traffic Control. We're carrying three passengers on a Wayland yutani bond. You're holding the Nostromo flight recorder unit. We request immediate permission to transfer the passengers port side over. This is Verlaine on the Torrens. What the hell just happened? So that was his un 
like scrambled message from the beginning of the game then. Damn. What, what was this? A blasting cap and a what? A sensor. Okay. Okay. That's really cool though, I mean, right? Like, how unique. Oh, it's just a ladder. I love that it gave us access to those, like, comms messages. Ion torch. Shit, so we come back here at a later time, I guess. Maybe when we need to contact help or something? Which I don't know why we're not trying to immediately get, like... Hello, Sir Punsby, my beautiful and fine, amazing friend. I hope you're healing up well. We're just exploring the, uh, the station while the Xenomorph is uh, still out there vented in space. So it's kind of a relaxing stream to some degree. I'm glad the pain meds were doing uh, were doing work. Sounds like you got a good doctor, which makes me happy. Also, I don't know if I ever replied to it or not, but I did hydrate Queen Sheeta, so if I never said anything, I did, and I'm sorry if I didn't. I just looked at the redeems and was like, wait a minute. <laughs> Restore power. Shit, okay. Pretty sure it's torn now. Damn. Well, definitely rest up, Punsby. Just sit down, relax. I chose door access, so why isn't that opening? Okay, that's weird. Item. Oh, okay. I missed it. Okay. 
Ah, an ID tag. Okay, cool. But don't you worry, buddy. Like I said, I'll be sending you those earrings once I finish them and buff them out. But I also will be sending you a, uh, I guess I can tell you, I'm going to be sending you a, um, a thing of taffy from uh, the Riverstone Cottage Gifts website. You were saying you love taffy, so I thought I'd send you something as I get well soon. Because you've been really supportive and absolutely amazing. And we're all really bummed to hear that you're in, like, in pain and stuff like that. And have gone through like a uh, bit of a hard time. So, No, I think I'm sweet enough. Plus, uh, you know... I think I'm probably zero sugar, to be completely honest with you. I'm just diet Mila right now. I'm not even... I'm not even artificially sweetened. Oh, wait. I've already accessed this computer. I don't know why I'm doing anything with it. Okay. The first day of the mountain, so now I'm on so I'm on now ski list vacation for another week. Hey buddy, don't think about it like that. Think about it just as you're on a kick back and relax kind of vacation. Like I know it I know it's a bummer. <laughs> I know, Punsby. I know. Posture check, stretch, and hydrate. Thank you, Ren. Oh, sorry I hit the microphone. I am so sorry everybody. Hell yeah, buddy. Those are the best vacations, in my opinion. Trust me, as somebody who's been, uh, like I said, stabbed and, like, if it has drowned before and all those other crazy situations, honestly, just chilling like a villain, way underestimated, like, how effective it is for, tr like, for helping... Legit last round. Nice. Also, did he really just say, like, the Borg line where he was like, resistance is futile? Motherfucker thinks he's a Borg. It's hilarious. Okay, we need a charge pack to be used. But look at our item wheel. We've almost maxed out on every item we could have. Like, that's really fucking good, you guys. Like, so if another alien does show up, which granted it probably will, we're going to just crush it, hopefully. Oh, that's sweet of you, Ren. Can always count on Ren can I just to be the absolute best. Item? Oh, already looted. Item? Oh, nothing. I'm like a meerkat whenever that shit happens. I'm like, huh? Like, super interested, like, tiptoe lean, perk up, like, where's, what's gonna be there? You always bring a smile to me, Ren, so that's something that can that's invaluable to me. Plus you've made a huge mark on me and this channel. I mean you've got your own freaking redeem, like that's a very exclusive club. I don't just give everybody a redeem. That's not how I roll. 
Okay, we need compound B. Bonding agent. Okay, uh, I mean, never go through pain for others like that. That's, you gotta value your own priorities too, but. Shotgun cocktail. Oh, I missed! Oh god, he was right in front of me too. I'm, I'm becoming hysterical, really. Yeah, my turn now, motherfucker. A sensor. Oh, that guy had so much shit. Thank you. But yeah, we're also here for you as well, Ren. So if you're ever in pain or need a shoulder, like, we're always here for you. And never feel guilty about that either. I mean, it's never too late to learn lessons, Ren. So, don't fret. We've got your back, no matter what, okay? You're part of this little kind of tribe that I've more or less collected. I mean, hell, I've collected so many limited edition chatters. Like, I've got Punsby, I've got Glass, I've got you. Like, you know, guys are like the straight up, like, mint condition, like, collectible ones. Oh, hello, revolver ammo. And shotgun shells. He, that dude's almost single handedly just gave us all the ammo we just spent. If only I had hit my that missed shot, we would have been like net zero and two dead androids. I have a feeling that the androids are probably random because I was pretty sure that there was nobody there unless you just missed them, like like fucking magic or like they were like David Blaine or something. Okay, so seeks and security should take me to. Yep. Okay. And this over here, I don't know if that takes me. No, it doesn't. Mm. Let's look around up here real quick. Oh, hello. Device invalid. Damn, we need another upgrade to access that. Shit. Okay, yeah, it looks like we've completely explored this area for now. So that's dope. Uh, Project KG348. I think I said that right. That's where we cap the creature. That's kind of got a double meaning. Like, capped is in, like, Blasted it and then also captured it, so you know, double meaning. Awesome. Okay. Hmm. Well, hello. I don't know why I checked that when I should be checking the map. Oh, psh. that actually kind of legit startled me. I just opened the light and like, well, popped the light and then there's just a dead dude with blood smear. Like, holy crap. Can't use that sensor, unfortunately. Thank you, but no thank you, dead guy. Nothing. I wish you could, like, fast, just, like, shuffle when you're under here.
Also, you're never alone, Ren. Even if you think you are, we're always here in spirit for you. Pardon me. I always get really bad burps after I eat acidic food. You want cookies? If you were close by, I'd make you some, honestly. I love baking for people. Dude, you're still alive. Oh, hot huh, shit. Dude's still alive, you guys. Welcome back, puns, bud. Can't trust anyone. Gotta make my own way. If the game wouldn't penalize me for spraying you with fire, dude, I would. I always trust everybody. I'm just kidding. No, I don't. That's terrible advice. Never trust everybody. That shit would be abuse so freaking fast. You have no idea. Asking me not to worry, Ren, is like asking you not to apologize for, for things. It's just not gonna happen. that puns. That's the role of siblings, though. Just non-stop chitter-chatter. And they never back it up. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, yep, yeah, so that's everything here, too. Damn. We're doing pretty good with our uh, sweep-throughs, right? I think so, at least. I know it's not the most exciting gameplay, but I figured we've earned uh, an hour or two of peace, right? God, I hate this place. Hi, friend. I don't know you, but you look friendly enough. Uh, is... Come with me, please. Uh, no, no thank you. Ah! What the hell? Oh, I didn't load the stun cartridge. My bad. Tech lobby. Exoplant solutions. Let's go there. That probably takes us somewhere interesting, right? Oh, hey, I remember this area.
Yeah, I figured that would happen. Debating on what to do with your art now? What, what, what do you mean? Maybe we can help. Like, are you meaning, like, what to draw next? Well, post it in the Discord. We'd love to see it. Even if it is something spicy or... What the hell? Like, self-insert or anything. Like, doesn't matter. Post it in the DC. We'd love it. Also, I heard like a weird shriek just a moment ago. I don't know if anybody heard that, but it's a little alarming. We're just going to be a little on guard. Like a fencer. Oh, Bonnie Agent. Bonnie Agent and a sensor. Okay. It did sound like an alien shriek. I'm glad I'm not the only one who thought that. Which is weird because the xenomorph was vented, so that means there's probably another one somewhere. Yay! Hey. Yeah, they tend to do that, and we've seen enough dead bodies with their torsos ripped open in a circular pattern to support the theory that there's probably babies around here somewhere. Bonnie agent. Yeah. Good news is we got our trusty flamethrower if any some bitch wants to tango. I sure did a number on Verasica, so it should do a number on whatever else came from her. Five? Oh, please, please don't wish that bad luck on me. <laughs> I, I don't want five. Oh my goodness. Ren's like, maybe your worst nightmare has come to fruition. I'm just like, oh joy, thank you. <laughs> That's way too kinkily phrased there, Punsby. No, I don't think I will. It's my channel. <laughs> Oh, Jesus, you scared me. Is anybody there? Damn. You took two to the face. Get swarmed. Again, kinkily phrased, but okay. And I'm the one that needs to behave. No, 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 not you, Ren Kunai. We were, we were talking literally about uh, you saying that there were five xenomorphs at once, and I was saying, like, that would be a nightmare, and then Punsby phrased it in a non-siso way, so we were joking around with him. Don't worry, you're good. Even if you weren't being wholesome, I ain't gonna care. You're too delightful for us to care about that kind of stuff. That's obviously like about no boundaries, like that's about it. That's all I ask. <laughs> We're all adults. Oh jeez. Andrew just woke up. Hello, friend! What a wake-up call! Oh, you are totally a fucking alive. Yep. That's how we get shit done, you guys. 
Open a pod and blast a bitch. There's still another one around here? Oh, Jesus. It is a scary way to wake up, that's for sure. I I do wish there was a, an active dismemberment feature where, like, we blasted him point blank with a shotgun. His head would have looked like a fucking watermelon exploding. Like, <laughs> that would be so satisfying, though. Like, and, like, that, like, white fluid, like, from their blood goes everywhere. And that meant, even that statement makes me like that was that could have been phrased a little bit better, but you get my point. <laughs> yeah, I know puns. I know. <laughs> Fun fact: Did you know that that uh, white blood in the movies is actually just milk and cottage cheese? And that the actors were just spitting it out violently. Oh, jeez. Somebody came in here and just went kaboom and blasted that dude. Okay. Awesome. That means you're part of the cool kids gang. this looks like a shipping container area call freight oh we just accessed a whole new area I think whoa dope Actually, almost all of them were. And nobody knew what the creature design looked like or any of that. Like, that was all just to surprise the actors to get a genuine reaction. really dope though we get we're in like the whole new area I want to explore this area a little bit Let's see what's in here Okay, so that's KG348 again. Charge packs. Oh, jeez. That would be scary. Oh. Hold up, friend. I'm reloading. Gentlemen's duel! Wipe. Ew, and he had a ponytail. Everybody had ponytails. They were like the ponytail gang. 
What is this dude doing? God, what were they doing before I killed them? Some weird shit was going on up here, I'm gonna tell you that much. Pop, pop. Let's do this. Come on. Alright. Cut along the lines, Miwa. There we go. Did you actually know that the whole reason that there was uh, the Xenomorphs actually look different in the uh, original uh, movie to the sequel was actually a production reason and not at all like lore? That they just disguised it as lore and gave like a whole unique explanation to all of that? So the original Xenomorph had a glass dome for its like makeup for its head and when James Cameron was making Aliens, he didn't want a bunch of glass domed suits running around and running amok and stuff like that and breaking and, like, making his budget go, like, out the window. So they designed a more, like, plastic, rigid design that became synonymous with the Xenomorph, and that was the, the, the practical reason for the invention of the Warrior Xenomorph. Yeah, you were right, Punzi. Good job, my friend. Bonding agents. Let's see. Yeah, you do, my friend. Even on pain medication. A round of applause for cleanse me. But still, we unlocked the whole secret area. I'm like, that was pretty freaking cool. So, yeah. I'm probably gonna have to come back to that area later on at a later date, I imagine. Not that. It does feel a little too safe. It's because there's no Xenomorph in a muck right now. So it's it's definitely giving me kind of like a moment of levity. A much needed one. If you guys have watched the last couple of VODs or anything or seen the last couple of streams. This game does not pull punches. So like while there's no Xenomorph running amok, I'm running everywhere and grabbing all the things that I missed. So in case there is another Xenomorph, like that hiss we heard earlier implies that may be the, like, it might be better for our progression if we do all this stuff while it's not hunting us actively, right? That's, that's my thought process anyway. Yeah, go take care of your health, Ren. We'll see you eventually some other time in the Discord or via DM or whatever, however you want to talk to us. We love you and take care of yourself. Engineering decks. We'll check out the engineering decks real quick. Uh, I beg, I beg thy pardon. Every noise I hear freaks me out. Where the hell does that thing come from? I mean, we got a free one, so we might as well just blast him, right? A charge pack. Well, glad we killed those innocent bystanders. And just in time for the elevator to arrive. I heard that voice and was like, <laughs> like I was, I was quick on that draw. I was like, wait a minute.
<laughs> I imagine it was based on how organic it, it sounded just for you to type out. Believe it or not, dope sauce is part of my daily vocabulary too. And the term, uh, Lordy Roo, which I say a lot. <laughs> Ion torch required, okay. Yeah, my brother says that one a lot too. <laughs> you say it with like so. I, I just imagine you saying that with such defeat in your voice, like, oh my god, it's 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 happening. Okay, still can't do anything in here, it looks like. Got it. <laughs> yeah, only because of that, I'm sure. Charge packs, ethanol. Get charge packs and ethanol. Let's go. Maltage. Bonding agent. Okay, so bonding agent. Would have been smarter to use my reload on that, but what else? I'm liking our out, like our. Uh, I had an IRL friend of my uh, friend find my channel and he set my RRR to his fucking ringtone. I don't know what to do about it. Best part is he doesn't he, he doesn't know it's me. Oh my god, that's hilarious. I see something over here. Yep, it's an android. Why not ask me about the festival safety protocols? It's own kind of fun little hell, isn't it? We've already recovered most of our revolver ammo we've spent, so nice. Honestly, that'd be kind of a cool thing to do. But it's up to you, obviously. It's your voice. I've heard your voice before. You'd make a pretty like pretty damn good like voice actor for like for small projects like that and stuff. I'm voice acting a game I'm making, which is where I practice, where the practice came from. Oh, that's dope. I didn't even know that. That's awesome, man. What kind of game is it? I don't know if you've ever told me about this. I feel bad for not knowing. You did tell me. It might, it might just slip my mind. I got so many talented peeps sometimes it's hard to keep track of all of your guys' like, lore. Like, IRL lore. Saying life story, it sounds a little bit more like 
condescending, so I tried to say survival horror. Ooh, is it like a video game? Station serving the San Cristobal Medical Facility and season synthetics. The creature uses your mic to mimic how you sound. That is creepy and cool. Strangers will be shot. Cool. <laughs> oh, that's devilish. Is there like a plot or a storyline, or is it like a uh, multiplayer style, like oriented game where it's more about the experience? You have a whole website? Oh my god, link it! You can link it in chat and in the Discord. I would love to look into that. Damn. You're crazy talented, Punsby. Colonial pigs. Cool. That seems nice. Fun fact, survival horror is my favorite genre of video game. So, if it comes to Xbox, I would definitely love to play it. Even if it's like just an indie game and whatnot, I would love to have that honor. Even if that's the case, that's nothing wrong with that sites usually do that so it's you know it's all good how long have you been working on the game i assume for about four years oh my oh that's an alien reference there's a security alert firing off in the labs nearby elevators are out looks like the seats and synthetics are hell yeah tiny model snooping around so how do i get up you have to climb there's a service vent through to the elevator shaft around there somewhere okay Hang on, guys. I'm trying to... Planet you are... Okay, I'm going to read this for chat. The planet you are on is, Kel... uh, is Kepler-452b, a planet with a very strange ecosystem where most of the life forms are similar to Earth but are either bigger or can deliver a deadly neurotoxin if you are bitten. Jesus. However, this did not stop humanity from colonizing the planet as we developed an antidote for the toxins and tried to create predators to eradicate the other native life forms while leaving the humans alone. This, however, went very wrong, which is where you and your team of six armed guards and five detectives come into play. Your task to find out how and why the creatures signed the code Entity 9499 escaped. What could possibly go wrong? The answer is everything. Shortly after arriving at the facility, the group splits up and all but one guard go with each detective while the one that remains behind is tasked with keeping track of all the others. However, as you go through the facility, you get distracted by a sound. When you turn around, the person you were with has disappeared, and all that's left is a pile of red goo. You quickly realize that the entity which was, not, uh, which was thought to have left the facility never left, but also broke the eggs that were produced with the first generation of it labeled entities 9499-1, 9499-2, 9499-3, 9499-4, Can you survive and find the others, or will you join the countless others aboard the facility that have already lost their lives to these creatures? The choice is yours. About the studio. Produced by Punster Studio and is a one-person personal project. 
My name is Owen, and I am the only person working on this game, so please take that into account, as it is bound to have bugs and other glitches, as this is my first big game. I am a high school student, and am from Ohio. This game is based on a recurring nightmare I had when I was younger. However, I decided it was, since it was a creature that was unlike anyone on Earth, I would set it on a different planet. The skills I have are that I learned 3D animation and designing, and have also made several small Unity games. Really? You gotta tell us about those small Unity games, man. Partially taken from Starship Troopers. As I said, I have a whole fucking custom made website with a bot UT. Nice. Still have it from time to time. Nice. It's a rage shooter. Ooh. I had no idea of any of this, fun stuff. That's amazing. A little known fact that some people might not know when I was a teenager that was originally my go-to plan for when I graduated was to become a video game developer hi Yumi hydrating then achievement voices of Sevastopol don't be mad I went through the elevator shaft and shut the access door behind me I had a Joe on my tail so I had to get out of here if you can find any something to cut to the panel the code is 8282 uh, 8382 don't worry if not, I'm coming back for, down for you now. No sign of the lovebirds, but I've got a whole heap of guns and supplies up here. Russell. Oh, wait. What? It sounds like it. I'm excited to possibly play that on the on stream. That would be amazing. Also, if anybody doesn't know, this is a reference to how Ash tried to almost kill Ripley in Alien 1 by shoving the magazine down her throat. It was a really scary scene for anybody who... Experienced that as a younger person. But how are you, Yumi? I hope you're doing amazing. <laughs> Sounds like it. 83, 82. Oh no, are you kidding me? Is it still like in production or is it like like lost to time? So I had to start it over. Damn, I'm so sorry to hear that. We're on a new art piece, how are you? I'm doing pretty good. What, what kind of new art piece? In production, hell yeah. Hell yeah, man. That's how you do it. Never give up on your dreams. That's super awesome, Punsby. You bet your, you bet your ass I'm going to be playing that as soon as it comes out. We are no stranger to streaming awesome and amazing indie games. I was catching that from the the descriptor hints. But also, I hope uh, I'm also saying your name right. I've always said Yumi. I don't know if it's supposed to be yummy, like yummy ramen. So if I've been saying it wrong this whole time, please let me know. I don't want to get any of you guys' names wrong. That would make me feel super embarrassed. It's a play on words, so it's both. Okay, cool. But what kind of art piece are you working on? I'm really interested. I don't remember the last time I, I got to see any of your art. I hope I follow you on, like, wherever you post it. I'm pretty sure I follow you, I think, on Twitter. Let me check. 
if you're on there. Let me check. Oh, it doesn't say anything. Let's check, like, Twitter real quick. Hang on. There you are. No, I was not following you. Oh my goodness. I feel so stupid. Hang on, let me look it through some of your amazing artwork. Got some dope pictures. Doesn't look like any of your artwork's posted here, actually. Oh man, I was kind of hoping to see. Fun story, when working on the AI for the creature, I gave it my voice as a test. Well, we forgot to turn it off at night. And got to hear myself ask, where are you and who are you? It was the scariest shit ever. That would be scary. That would be certainly very scary. Uh, I have one question, though. Is it going to be something that can be playable solo? Because I often have a hard time, like, getting multiplayer stuff on stream. Okay, cool. And is there, like, a story mode or anything like that? Like, I'm, I'm just trying to learn as much about it as possible, because... Honestly, the, the, that fascinates me. It can mimic the NPC AI. Awesome. It's just fan art, and I don't post on Twitter yet. Is there anywhere you do post? I would love to see it. Like, I genuinely would love to see it. It's only a story mode. Awesome. Synthetics go to die. Are you in my Discord server, Yumi? If not, then I would love to give you the, the link. Science documents and the truth about the creature's DNA is revealed by them too. So it's kind of like Signalis in a way. Or it's like classic survival horror where you learn as you go. Oh, okay. Hell yeah. Okay, let me give you the Discord link. I am so sorry. I thought you were part of the Discord. I must be thinking of somebody else because, like, you're awesome. I can't believe I never got to give you an invite. Um, let's see. Invite members. Copy. Paste. There you go, Yumi. Making a pixel art version of it, too, where it's a platform. That sounds fascinating. Uh, if you ever can or ever want to... Oh, what the fuck? This is creeping me out. Let's, let's finally test these explosive containers. Yep, okay, they work. I hate that it... Ejects all shells. But, uh, yeah, definitely go on to, uh... Go on to, uh... The... Like, Twitter. I, 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 I'm gonna have to make a list. You know, did boom container go boom? Exactly. It does. That's what I was wanting to make sure it did. Because Glass said it did, and she googled it, but I wanted to see how big of a boom it was. Uh, but, yeah, I've... I know some amazing, uh like 3d artists who will like who can send you 3d files for shit like that and they work pretty cheap and they like they can make things look like like a really old retro like ps1 style aesthetic and stuff like that or other kind of things so i could definitely send you a list of some of the people who could ever possibly be of assistance to you if you ever wanted to just like kind of uh, like export some of the uh, the lifting to, to other people. Oh, 
Hell yeah. Okay. I will give you a list of them pretty soon once I what after I, my stream and once I have free time I'll go through and know and like check out which ones I follow that are doing uh that have open commissions. Your name to the science team of the <laughs> that that blows me away. Uh, that's very kind of you. You don't have to, but I appreciate those kinds of gestures. Custom no. desk. I can't get near. Hell yeah. <laughs> I appreciate that. Okay, so let me go around here and make sure I'm not missing anything. It ain't no thing, Miss Thing. Okay, um, let's check here. Access tuner. Oop. Oh shit. Uh, weird hash. S Death Star. Weird jungle gym piece. There could be a mock-up of your stream layout with your name in that. Oh, that's awesome. That would be so cool. I'm honored beyond words, my friend. I cannot wait to play that game. Hello, Thunder. We were just talking about, about Punsby's game that he's developing. Did you know Punsby's a video game developer? Like, that shit's crazy. I had no idea. <laughs> Talk about a badass just casually sitting there and not resting on his laurels, just doing that, like, heavy lifting himself. Just got back home. Nice. Like back home, back home, or back home where you're like you're staying with uh, Ari, or are you already like flying back and like back home? They had web design for two years. Damn. This is Ransom speaking. I just woke up to find a working jewel in my suite, and when I asked what the hell it was doing, it lunched for me. I had to leave my own fucking apartment. Send your best technicians to Apollo Core and find out what the hell is going on now. Get those things under control. I want a full warrant ASAP. Um. Uh. Okay. I guess we're going through here. I must have access to Apollo. Open the tower. Apollo transit presents receipts and executive sensing headaches only. Right. Then I'll have to find a way to talk to Apollo directly. Biocontainment hazard level Olga. All permissions received. I don't have time for this. God! Look, okay, Sam is doing the absolute work. Don't fuck with. Wayland Yutani androids. Don't uh, don't tell people most of the projects I've done because I feel like it boasting or brag. Hey, that's not at all the case. It's not boasting or brag. It's advertising. You gotta learn that, man. Like what I do for Riverstone Cottage Gifts isn't boasting or bragging. It's advertising. So never think talking about stuff you do like that is a negative thing, Punsby. We all really, really love to hear that kind of stuff and support you. We were eating to Coca-Cola one. What? High school, about one, like, Jesus. Oh, the candy cola. Oh, yeah, I love those. Those are my favorite. I was a little confused. I'm sorry. That's my bad. I didn't realize we were talking about the candy. Right. <laughs> Man, did we just waste those? 
I'm gonna load it. <laughs> no, don't be sorry, that was my bad. Not yours. They didn't want me to put these greedy bastards. I'm gonna take a quick bathroom break though, real quick. That's where I was gonna charge a dollar per student for the apps and spend three years on the app. Damn. God damn, that sucks. Hang on, I'm gonna I'm gonna take a quick bathroom break. So give me one quick minute, you guys. I'm back, everybody. Okay. Oh, wait, I should probably, uh, should probably grab a drink. I mean, a dollar per student is fair. I thought they were like, best we can offer is 500. Yeah, that's bullshit. Well, they didn't get any of the files for it, and I said spent double on having a company make one recently, and it now costs them like three grand a year to keep the app up. Jeez. <laughs> that's fucked up, Punsby. I'm sorry that you went through that. I'm gonna run and grab a, uh, some ice for my drink and get a refill. But also, I wanted to ask before I bounced again, what genre of gameplay? Like, I know it's a survival horror, but, like, are we talking, like, a third-person shooter? Like, a first-person shooter crafting kind of game? Like, I, don't, I, I would love to know that as well, so I'll be right back.
Now I'm back, everybody. Okay. Hi, Paris. Oh my god, I'm sorry I was away. Oh my goodness. Okay. Uh, first person, however, I'm gonna make other perspectives as well. Okay, so... If I can lend you a little bit of advice, stick to one perspective and nail it. That is way better than trying to fit all the puddles, basically. No, no, no. You're, what you're going to do is you're going to make it $20. $20 is fair. If it's like in-game preview, that might be understandable for 10 Never sell yourself short. Then make it exclusively first person. I love all genres of gameplay, but I honestly want you basically to like limit all of the work that you had. Because this would be different if you had a team, like a team of people who've been doing this forever. But since you're a solo developer, I'm going to tell you like that stuff. Because I used to help uh, like that kind of area of business. That's what I did before I started streaming. Yeah. So, I was helping, like, artists know their value, know their worth, sell their work. Like, I was doing all that in an art studio. So, like, w just, yeah. Well, we can help you every step of the way. And I also told, I also ran across the hall, the hall in, uh, when I was getting ice for my cup. I told, uh, the Riverstone Cottage Gifts... Uh, about it, and they were like, oh my god, is this the same Punsby, like, <laughs> makes video games? I was like, yep. And I will help whenever I can as well, my friend. Even if it's something as simple as writing up, like, email exchanges or lore bits, because I used to be a writer as well. So. you got a whole-ass Discord ready and willing to help and support, so. Never, ever doubt yourself or undersell yourself. The door up here is blown. I can't get near it. I will definitely peruse it once I can. Uh, for like ease of access, the there should be a uh, a category where I have uh, here. I'll figure out its name on my Discord. Hang on, just a minute. It's loading. So. Let's see, where is it? Oh yeah, there's a category that says amazing shoutouts, and it's the shoutout room. Definitely put your link to that in there, please. Yeah, like, that's what I'm saying, like... Do one thing and do it better than to do all things and do it mediocre. And when I asked what the hell it was doing, it lunched for me. I had to leave my own fucking apartment. Send your best technicians to a police hell yeah, buddy. and find out what the hell is going on now. Get those things under control. I want a full report ASAP. You're amazing, Bunsby. And I want you to know that. Biocontainment has a level Omega. We don't forget the little...
Pixel one is going to be you scarier because of the little tricks I know for perspective and other stuff. Yeah, that stuff can be tricky. So definitely, I what I would suggest is shelve that one and work on one entirely. Even if you wanted to, like, okay, so here's my idea. And if you, this is a completely just out there. So if you're going to do two, make the micro, like, pixel game first to kind of build that franchise. And, like, you could have it, like, be, like, a campy retro spin. Like, you call it, like, Super Entity 996 or whatever. Like, how I, I forget what the, the number the designation is, but, like, and make it, like, classic, like, old, like, Nintendo kind of graphics. And then once people are like, oh, man, this game is great, and, like, they give it a shot and love it, then you could definitely use that momentum to then build on the first-person game. So kind of like how uh, there's a Metroidvania that came out not that long ago called, uh, uh, what's it, like... I can't even remember what it's called, like, uh, Bloodstained, that's what it is. Bloodstained, like, Curse of the Blood Moon or something like that. And the developer knew it was going to take some time, so he went and made the old, like, retro pixel game first, and people were talking about that for, like, for, like, months and years, and then once the actual game came out, there was a generous amount of hype for it. Oh, posture check, stretch, and a hydrate. Thank you, Dee Dee. Welcome to the stream. But don't, don't let me tell you how to do all of your stuff. I'm just giving my free advice and suggestions, and you can, f you can feel free to say, like, fuck you, and I'll be like, oh, okay, fine, whatever. Like, I ain't gonna take offense to it. <laughs> just free advice. That's how I look at it. The way that the standing is freaking me out. <laughs> See if I can make the 2D multiplayer, but I'm mainly focusing on the solo aspect of it. Probably focus entirely on solo for that one. Yeah, that's that's important. Like atmosphere is the best. I put that lower when I was fifteen. Damn, like. When you think you can't get any more badass, you just randomly get more badass, Bunsby. Apollo Transit reserved for Sikhs and executives and synthetics only. Right. Then I'll have to find a way to talk to Apollo directly. Biocontainment has a level Omega. All permissions rescinded. I don't have time. Oh. Posture check, stretch, and hydrate again. Thank you, Thunder. I have, I think, 24 concept artworks. Oh, man. Release those in the, the art chat when you can. I would love to look through the Concept art for video games is one of my favorite, like, like, favorite things to look at. Even if it's by hand or by you or by whoever. I would love to see those, buddy. Like I said, you got a whole Discord of people who specialize in various different things, so we all would love to probably help in some way or another, even if it's just, like, giving some support. Was this one always standing like this? I feel like he was making a gesture and now he's just stock still. I'm a little alarmed. Okay. Um.
Hmm. What am I meant to do here? <laughs> Isn't that all of us, buddy? right now I'm really fascinated oh that's interesting but yeah definitely with the right help and like the right like people you could definitely make that like come to life and help you out a little bit I feel Find a way to escape some Oh, maybe I guess I gotta go talk to Samuels. Move the tail. I actually think, like, if you gave it, like, a bladed tail like a xenomorph, that would be kind of cool as well. Restore power. Find Samuels, find a way out of the synthetic showroom. Okay. Let's look around, I guess. Mix of a horse, praying mantis, and redacted. <laughs> I love that you included and redacted. You can already tell you like this. And I love it. Love to see it, friend. Where the hell am I going? But yeah, your skill, your personality, and your generosity all blow me away, Punsby. Is the Woodstalker. Ooh. The wild and it mimics the woodland sound to hide in plain sight. That is pretty cool. You ever done that old sci-fi trick of like seeing how the creature's name sounds in like different languages and possibly having like that have some influence over how its name is spoken because that can be super cool sometimes as well but I digress <laughs> where was the motion spike You've got invested fans now. Oh, so this is where we came in from. Okay. I 
Oh yeah, so if it's spoilers, definitely don't reveal that. We'll just have to figure that out the hard way. But seriously, man, like, that blows me away that you're just so casually humble about developing a fucking video game. <laughs> Okay then, it doesn't look like there's anything I can grab out here that would help. Let's look at the terminal again. Blank androids for the VIPs to sale. If you haven't done it before, just tell just have them lie on the slab in the reformat chamber. It'll collect to Apollo and upgrade them with the latest programming. The lower ribcage to hold in, in both the digestive acid and all that left is the bones of armor. Oh, Jesus. I'll take uh, horrible ways to die for 500, Alex. Thor Wald Jaeger. The Vald Jaeger sounds way cooler. Just, even if you had to forego the Durr, like the Vald Jaeger, that sounds way cooler and like more ominous. That also could be my bias because my father's German, so. Okay, so. We gotta make them re like system reboot. I guess. Um uh, let's look around here. The only reason it's still in English is on the say is I had lost my password. Oh, no, that, that, that makes sense, but I'm just saying, like, for the finished product. That's what I mean. Like, not on the... Like, I'm not, like, worried about, like, corrections like that on the website. The Vald Jaeger sounds just way... Way more badass, in my opinion. So... That was simply what I was saying. Okay. Like... Like, what am I supposed to do here? I am confused. Oh. Well. Well, don't I feel stupid. Okay. Hey at night. Okay, so, uh, yeah, that's not effective. <laughs> Tiger lady. <laughs> she rolled her eyes until she heard the treat bag. Sit. 
There you go, sweetheart. Thank you for the munch redeem, Dee Dee. <laughs> she squinted and rolled her eyes, and then I shook the bag, and she was like, oh, shit. Okay, let's uh, reload that. Now that I know what I'm doing, I feel like I can get through this quicker. I feel stupid. <laughs> okay, uh, let's see. Um, let's go. Place. <gasps> that is creepy. Oh, well. I thought that was the pile of bodies that it got up from. Good. Easy as pie. Death Star, half V, Jungle Gym piece, weird hash mark. I give them all weird little unique names to help my brain puzzle through things like that. If anyone's ever curious why I say stupid shit like that. Is there no oh, yeah. The ID tag. Got everything of worth before I leave this area. So. Okay. More projects I haven't shared before. Well, if any of them are released and I can, I can have access to them. Let me know, because I would love to see that shit. Yeah. I would love to have that link. Speaking of Negative Ransom speaking, I just woke up to find a working Joe in my suite, and when I asked what the hell it was doing, it lunched for me. I had to leave my own fucking apartment. Put your best technicians to a polar core and find out what the hell is going on now. Get those things under control. I want a full report ASAP. Who else hopes this ransom guy got killed by an android? Apollo transit reserved for seeks and executives and synthetics only. Right, then I'll have to find a way to talk to Apollo directly. Biocontainment has a level Omega. All permissions rescinded. I don't have time for this. Shapoople. You do not have an appointment. Pardon me, sir. Small quick game I made, it's even harder than it looks. Ooh, I'm checking it out right now. Whoa. It looks neat. Wow. Like, honestly, man, that looks, that shit looks dope. I've only ever beaten it once. That is pretty cool.
Okay, you guys. Yes. It was it also won a Unity contest for three micro games. That's pretty cool, Punsby. You can see a lot of passion goes into what you do, so I'm proud of you. But here's I guess if we miss the shotgun. Flashlight batteries revolve. Oh, it's giving us a lot of ammo. I'm a little nervous. Okay, free Molotovs, like pre made. Damn. And medkits? <laughs> Why so generous, game? Jeez. Like, you're talented. I'm, I'm blown away by that. Let's go back and roast the other two androids preemptively with uh, the free f uh, Molotovs that we've got access to. Just in case. You never know. <laughs> Yeah, sounds like the alien is probably about to return. <laughs> you also know how to do fluff. Of course you do. <laughs> Jesus. Gas diver. Now it sounds like they're probably about to come through that. Maybe not. A little, a little unnerving. I'm not gonna lie. Is there no save station? Oh, it says there is. Lordy Roo. <laughs> How did I miss that? Those aren't random, my friend. Those are like, those are valuable skills you've got. Like, crazy valuable skills. Blasting cap. Uh, yeah, I guess we can do that. Oh, ID tag. Like. Jesus, did you take it? That's probably more than I've made my whole life so far. God damn. Wayland Yutani Synthetic Registered. Attempted unauthorized access. Well, damn, get a degree and just. God damn, buddy. Like. Sounds crazy.
I know, again, that's easier said than done, but, like, you're a prodigy, like, in the works. It's crazy. Just the idea of that alone says a lot about your character, Funsby. Also, just being my friend is support enough for me, so ne you never worry about that. Nothing. Just my shit in the station. Fucking. <clears throat> now, this is creepy. I hope your parents are, pri are as proud of you as, as is like we all are, because you, you just are a badass. My fan at night. 700 bucks once and legit watched a streamer cry after I sent. Turns out it was just enough for them to get him a much needed. Oh my god. See, like, like that shit's what I'm talking about, Punsby. You're absolutely amazing. And it blows my mind that you're so humble. I mean, fuck, I cry, like, if I get, like, five dollars sometimes. Like, when when Thunder and, uh, the RSCG, uh, got me to the, my donation tier on, uh, my horror game donation tier, I was just baffled. After I've dedicated myself to helping others because I've been in bad positions before, it is... It is nice to help others, and that is a very admirable goal. I've also been in many a bad position before. Oh my god, really, dude. Lay down. Lay back down, old man. Oh my god. Dude, I was in the middle of killing your ally. <laughs> Never feel obligated, Punsby. It's just a mere statement. Okay. Blitzkrieg attack! Them motherfuckers did not know who they were fucking with.
Somebody just went to town on this motherfucker. Hell yeah, charge pack. I like how they're giving us options to sneak through here. It's like, I am me with a fox. I don't sneak when I can stand my ground and fight. I'm a proud motherfucking Native American. I will kick your ever-loving fake motherfucking ass. Oh, that's one of those sturdy cams. Dang, okay. But, oh, excuse me. I am so sorry. Shit, I heard motion. I go. Uh, this dude's got problems. and legit got the streamer and he set up which I felt really good about. <laughs> are, are we sure Punsby's not like a literal angel? Ripley, like from biblical alive. like descriptors? I can't be sure anymore either. Mm, your actions and kindness beg to differ. They're like one of them old school motherfucking saints. And I'm not meaning from like the Saints Row franchise. Like you, I don't see you sitting on the street corner with like a, a Glock. I, I wouldn't know. I, I've honestly, I've never fully read the Bible. I know. Believe me, I can be a bish too. But uh, like, like I it, and before anybody judges or like gets upset by that or like tries to quote unquote save my soul, it's all been done before. I'm a Native American. That's just not what we believe in. So. <laughs> Just for... <laughs> I know it's not... I'm not really talking to you guys. I'm more talking to, like, anybody who's, like, a lurker or, like, a, a YouTube watcher exclusively. Yeah, you you would think Samuel, logically like that. Yes, far too dangerous. Wish me luck. Samuels, don't! Oh, what's this motherfucker doing? Don't be a martyr, Samuels! You were one of the cool androids! Fuck, man, what are you doing? More than likely. I find one thing funny when I say I am Catholic that they are like, wait a minute, you are, uh, you are, and it's funny. <laughs> Is 
socket. There was an upturned gurney nearby. We're gonna save you, Samuels! Thank you for the hydrate. Okay. Whew. Tiger lady. <laughs> the way she like gets all up and like. <gasps> Here you go, Babel. I love that dog. She's great. Are you okay, Samuels? Rest in peace. If you're there, yeah. pick up. I'm here. I'm here. Sorry. Samuels is gone. Shit. He opened Apollo Transit for me. I'm gonna go straight there. I'll get Apollo to lift the lockdown. Shit. I mean, he was no bishop, but he was he was definitely a badass. Definitely the coolest, unique model of Android I've seen in the expanded, like, universe. This person had cra- what the hell? Okay. Let's go talk to this Apollo then. Oh shit. Uh, ah shit, I was not gonna be able to escape them. Oh wait. It did not equip my shotgun. Fuck. hydrating right now. Thank you. Keep hydrating, I guess. <sighs> Thank you for that. I hope you've been having an amazing time. It seems like it from all the stuff I've seen. Red lights on. I want data. 
the location of the planetoid where you found the derelict. All data you have on the origin of that organism. I can Jesus. And a way off the station. You just have to let me out. I can probably agree to this, Tess. What the fuck? Taylor! Taylor, get me out of this cell right now! Get me out! Ow! Fuck. I heard it. So Taylor was secretly evil. Bitch. Yeah, let me clean my smudges. It's always Wayland Yutani, isn't it? Somewhere, somehow. Even from the shadows, it's always Wayland Yutani. Building better worlds. Achievement unlocked. A synthetic solution. Nice. I wish those showed up on uh, stream. Above the Apollo core. This whole area contains Apollo supportive systems with the AI core itself at the center. Apollo prevented signals from lifting the lockdown remotely. But once you're inside, he made sure it'll at least talk to you. Samuels was a G, that's for sure. Sounds about right. Firearms detected. You've got to be shitting me. Place firearms on security conveyor. Mason and Apollo, thank you. I'll bet. I better be getting those back, game. I am not about to let that slide. It's time we go around in a circle, so uh, let's look around. Oh. Okay, let's see. There's a power conduit that links to the Apollo core. Uh, this is making me remember aliens. Turn off the electric. What's my preferred bow? Breeze, Heavy bow, long bow, or short bow? Long bow. I'm not coming up there to pull you out if you get stuck. Very specific and interesting question, by the way. So thank you for that. Okay. What was I supposed to do? 
Power down the conduit. Oh, okay. Move, 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 move. There we go. Um, was there a utility thing in this that I just didn't see? Some way to get around here, I just noticed. Oh, Shisa, okay. Um, password. Uh, let's look through our logs real quick. Try to remember this time 4930. down first. Okay. Are you kidding me? Better not be fucking androids in here. Death Star, Jungle Gym Peace, Backwards E, Weird K. Here we go. Ricardo, conduits offline for now. I've pulled up the Apollo yeah. schematics here. Yeah. It looks like you can get to the access to the today. turbine shaft. The key my requisition to ask There'll be an emergency shuttle here, Brian. But it won't train. stay off forever. They you have to get inside about quick. a hazard containment order, tried to get into my control booth, and then just marched off. I know I always complain about those spooky bald bastards, but now I've got proof their wiring's broken. I've got a meeting with your boss spedding tomorrow, and I'm gonna kick some ass. So when he starts kicking well, it's coming from me. Okay. Nothing in here, it looks like. Oh, there's androids down there. Jungle Jim Peace, hash mark. S and a backwards E. Turbine's off. Way should be clear. Better run. If Apollo systems overheat, they'll reboot. What's a good SSD card that I could buy? Any ideas? Um, are we? What are we talking about? Like consoles? Are we talking about like PC? Because I don't have a PC really. Well, uh, I've. Heard my mom loves Seagate, but I really don't know for certain. But uh, I guess that's what I could recommend. Get here. I've got to try. I thought he was a pretty nice guy for a synthetic. Me too. Reminds me of the bishop saying, not bad for a human. Ricardo, the main entrance is locked. Any idea what to do next? Ricardo? Sick. If you can hear me, find another way to make contact. Something's up with my earpiece. Something crazy just happened. 
master ball is off the market. We gotta buy it. The weeks before they start taking the place apart. Gas mask, okay. After all those endless presentations and tours, I guess the talks weren't stalled at all. Some of the company headquarters just had to click his fingers. A message of confirmation just came in. Apollo's currently receiving a packet of new operational booth sets. So, I guess the deal's sealed. Cool, so Apollo was bought out. Probably by Wayland Yutani, which is probably why we're here. Oh shit. He's resistant to electrical impulse. That's no good. That was a scary admit listen to learn. What? Oh, Shisa. That was scary. Okay, give me one minute. I'll be right with you, sir. Could you kindly step the fuck down? Ah! Okay, uh... Godspeed, Kimusabi! Ah! <laughs> yeah, I think wearing electrical resistance stuff helps with that. Yeah! I noticed it after I tried EMP him. At least we got him, though. Fucking game decided, like, oh, you're no longer alien? Now we gotta deal with androids. Oh, I bet we can freeze them. Oh, put them on ice, okay. So if we get, if we get stuck doing this again, we at least have a uh, plan of action. That's good. Security access tuner. Ashmark. Oh, Tiger Lily Munch in the mint. V. There, and a Death Star. Come here, Tiger Lily. Okay. Come here, Tiger Lily. There you go. Thank you for the munch, redeem, and then the posture check, stretch, and a hydrate. Thank you, Arctic. My dog sure appreciates it. She's licking my leg right now. Like a little weirdo, but we love her. Ask you about Sevastopol's safety protocols. Oh, 
Oh god. Ah, fudge. Uh, I'm good, thank you. Oh jeez, these guys are tougher than the normal type. Oh god! Pop it! Like it's hot. Like it's hot. Let's go. Oh, they flanked me, these motherfuckers. Oh, God. You're becoming hysterical. Bitch. Haha, <laughs> see ya, suckers. Wanna ask me about Sevastopol's safety protocols? Bitch. Low power. Uh, let's see. A Molotov, I guess, would help, maybe. No, that's not gonna help. Wait, I don't understand. Why am I? Why was I not allowed to use the dome access? Oh, on this. Okay. Come on. Hash. Up. Oh, jeez. Okay. Find a way to reduce Apollo's safety. Capabilities. Of course, why not? It's what I do best. You heard it, you guys. It said basically go and break stuff. Can we do it with just the one? Curious. Yes, we can. It's just gonna be hard. Got it! Fuck yeah, you guys! See that shit? My elite hacking strats. Seen. We haven't gotten one of these in a while. I wish it played at a more stable frame rate. What the hell? Wait, you special ordered 9389. What? Of course they do. Purchase order received. You're kidding me. Protect specimen, maintain station quarantine, disallow communications. Sounds All other precious. considerations secondary. It isn't on the damn station.
sons of bitches. Fuck. Here, I guess. Wayland Utani, building better worlds. Uh, <laughs> oh no. Fuck. You guys <laughs> Wayland Utani bought out fucking Seekson's company and Oh my god. This is bad. <laughs> and what no jack about the buyout, but if they hear rumors about a disappearing people problem. I don't want to rock the boat, and neither do you. Let's just keep everything nice and quiet so we don't have the games. Jesus. Oh my god. Oh, what a twist. Fucking. Well done, game. Achievement unlocked. Consult. Uh, consultation. The I'm sorry, that achievement should have been called Building Better World. Where was the uh, power cable? Oh, over here. Okay, one of these. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to prob... Uh, hi, hi, Psycho Blood Bunny! How are you? Oh my goodness, welcome. We were just about ready to uh, start a raid, actually. I'm sorry I didn't... I'm sorry I caught you so, like, so late in the stream. I apologize on that front. But I always appreciate when you stop by, and so thank you for that. It, really makes it really makes me smile when I see you guys pop in uh, but yeah so uh, if you if you guys are watching this on YouTube be sure to like comment and subscribe as it really does help grow the channel uh, we will be continuing this tomorrow probably uh, I didn't want to do too much without glass present she's currently doing something today and I know she's adoring this play too so it would feel kind of wrong to forge John without her so until next time as always my name is me with the fox and I'll see all of you lovelies in the next video bye